Me, Medicine Cram, Tachycardia, Flashcard Set 8, Symptoms of Torsades de Points. And for those of you who are wondering what the concise definition of tachycardia is, it's an abnormally rapid heart rate. We'll get into a complete explanation of Torsades de Points, a few flashcards into this deck. And this deck of cards can be used for review for the National Council Licensure Examination. All right. The healthcare provider is caring for a patient with a diagnosis of hypomagnesium and a QT interval of 0.5 seconds. Which of these, if noted on the cardiac monitor, is an indication that the patient's condition is worsening. Is it A, narrow QRX complexes, A, I mean B, a polymorphic ventricular tachycardia, C, an RR interval of one second, or D, premature ventricular contractions? I'll give you a moment to select the correct condition. Okay, so let's first analyze answer choice C. An RR interval of one second translates um, to a heart rate of 60 beats per minute, which is in general a normal finding. Narrow QRX, so C is not the answer choice. Narrow QRS complexes are associated with a variety of tachycardias. Um, but is not expected in this particular situation. What is characteristic of um, the QRS complexes is this QT prolongation, you know, it's kind of stretch. And um, the morphology of the QRS complexes here are kind of like twists around the isoelectric line. So that's to be expected, okay, for um, a condition that I'm going to tell you in a second. All right. And the patient's history of hypomagnesemia and um, a prolonged QT interval puts the patient at risk for developing torsades, day points. So this is what's pictured here in this EKG. And in order for Tersaz de Points to be diagnosed, the patient must have evidence of both something called polymorphic ventricular tachycardia. So um, ding, 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 answer choice B, and QT prolongation. Okay. So um, the prolonged QT interval puts the patient at risk for developing torsade state points, which is a polymorphic ventricular tachycardia that can potentially degenerate into ventricular fibrillation. So the correct answer choice, again, is B. A polymorphic ventricular tachycardia would indicate the patient's condition is worsening.